Alrighty, folks. So here we go. I change things a little bit here and there. Uh, obviously, the rim is here, and it looks good. Um, the tire is still not holding the air. It only holds for about 12 hours, and today is Thursday, and uh, I'm heading out to work using the bike. So I'm expecting no issues whatsoever. A quick update on the belly. Put a funny looking blue. It gives it a nice uh, different look. Uh, put the switch over here for the rear. Put switch on the other side for the headlight. Okay, so she looks good. One thing I'm missing is this one light in the middle. Kind of sucks, but whatever. I don't worry about it now. But uh, it's uh, looking good. Clean the front rim a little bit, of course. Um, charging at 5 amps. Let me take a look. Can you see? 5 amps. So we'll see how that's going to go. Got the gloves for tomorrow. Did the setting for... 55 current on uh, the uh, motor. See how she handles. We are at. Yeah, can't see nothing. There you go. 77.7 volts. So she's going to be already ready. <coughs> right now it is. 1040 so she should be charged up in the morning no problem at work i'll charge it at one amp for the whole day i will have to take this charger with me because i don't think my other charger is actually charging at five amps it might be charging actually at one or two amps um seat cover again and uh i'm just shooting the video because i did the belly and I did the black, black kickstand, the real, the real, real kickstand you're supposed to have. Lashes and nuts over there. Painted black with a same paint bed liner that I did the uh, entire bike. So that should be nice. And uh, we should be ready for tomorrow, to be honest with you. Um, I'm spoke. Um, again, the tire holds here for 12 hours. I got two coming on a Monday. And of course, the 30th time, I'm going to take the tire, take the tube out, switch the tube, put a new tube, and put the tire back on. And I have to take the uh, spoke wrench so at work I can straighten her even more. And uh, hey, she's looking really sexy. Very nice. Loving it. Very nice build. Uh, now, question is, do I take the battery out for the winter or do I leave it? I would love to leave it so I can ride it whenever I want. So that might be the case. But until then, make sure you subscribe. You uh, like the video. You share with your friends. And uh, consider of uh, sticking around and maybe we can get some more footage. All right. If you have any questions about Kelly, about the battery, about my settings. So let's take a look what we're getting with our new motor. So we did 13.2 miles and our speed was 56 miles an hour. Beautiful thing. So far the 232 on this motor. So it's nice. Anyway, 56 is our bet. And this is at 55 uh, current on the motor. Imagine if I put it on 90. Just turn her off. Come on. Well, if I uh, huh, come on. Interesting. Why am I taking a picture? Oh, anyhow. Can I turn it off? Ah, there you go. Right, anyway, um, yeah, and again, tap that thing with Tony. Well, Tony did. I uh, just then held the damn bike. 
um, everything is ready for tomorrow. This thing is solid. I wish this one was just like, well, I wish the back one was like the front one. Just holding, holding the air. But anyhow, so she's a beauty. I love it. I love her. And uh, she's, hopefully we can continue riding. Oh, yes. We all know that I did do the brakes. They feel so good. It's not even funny. They break really well. Gotta love it. All right, folks. Until then, take care. Be safe. And we are here.